What's going on, everybody? Welcome from Fitness Inc. Hashtag Games. Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. Follow me on Instagram, Robert Fitness. Follow my band, Divided Dimension, on Spotify. If you guys are wondering why the fuck it's uh, it's like uh, our energy is kind of like different, it's, it's three in the morning. We're slap happy and we're reviewing some goddamn protein bars. Yeah. So what we got these at Target? Target, tone it up. Tone it up. Tone it up, Target. 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 That's how they Tone it up. Look at the games. Yes. So, this is like basically a plant based uh, protein bar, kind of like uh, wait, 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 wait. Like vegans and shit. What? Oh, no, yeah, hold on. Hold on, let's get some thumbnail. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yep. So, we got this box uh, at Target for six. I think it was eight bucks. And it was seven ninety nine. Seven ninety nine. So eight bucks for four. So it's two dollars a bar. Um, plant based, and they're pretty much vegan, obviously. And they're pretty much like it's kind of like marketing towards like women, kind of like toning it up, kind of like it's basically like chick bar. Yeah. Essentially, this is a birthday cake flavor. Uh, a little bit of background on this product. Uh, I've known about this group. The Tone It Up group has existed in Southern California for a long time. This, they're out of Manhattan Beach, California, these two girls. Uh, and they, yeah, they're marketed towards women and they started out as a fitness group. It's a whole lifestyle and they've developed this uh, supplement brand that I think is now available across the country in Target. Yeah, so we were, we were at Target in, in California and I was like, man, I think I've seen these before. So. I was thinking that they're kind of available everywhere, but I'm not really sure. I mean, we just co coincidentally, we're in California, and they're from California. So yeah. I don't know the availability of these bars. So tone it up, birthday cake. Let's go ahead and go over the macros real quick. 170 calories, 6 grams of fat, 2 grams of saturated. You have 19 carbs, only 2 grams of fiber, 8 grams of sugar, and 10 grams of protein. Protein blend is pea crisp. No artificial sweetener. Uh, nope, no nope. artificial sweetener. Nope. So the protein blend is of pea crisp, pea protein, rice starch, pea protein isolate, organic syrup, and then there's uh, like real ingredients and shit like that. What's the fiber? Um, that's a good question. There's only two grams. Is it chicory root? Ch yeah, it's uh, it's not chicory root. It's uh, rice bran. Rice what? bran. I'm not sure. Maybe like rice bran. Yep. Yeah. Uh. Chicory, oh, chicory, chicory, chicory root yep, fiber. Chicory root fiber, yep. yeah. and then chia seeds, flax seeds. Flax, yep. It's actually got like real, all yep. real ingredients. It's all real ingredients, no so. artificial stuff at all. No, yeah, it's yep. a real, so. It's a pretty, uh, yeah, uh, okay. the light pastel colors. Yeah, it's like appealing. Yeah, it's really appealing. Yeah. Let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and open up. All right. Let's see what happens here. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it definitely looks like a real food bar. Oh, yeah. It's like all seeds. You can see the, the pea crisps. Yep. Pea crisp. Uh, it's got it's pretty, some drizzle. It's pretty, it's pretty appealing. The drizzle's very symmetrical. Yeah. It's, ni it's nice it's, and appealing. It's very, like, consistent. It doesn't look like it was made in a factory. It looks like it was made by hand. Yep. Yeah. It's got crispies, everything. Smells pretty decent. It smells just like birthday cake. It's immediately soft. And nice. Mmm. Mmm. It, it tastes just like birthday cake. The flavor is the flavor is great. You can tell it's made out of real food, but it's carrying like a good birthday cake taste. It's chewy. What yeah. can what can you expect from a from a protein bar, though? Really, honestly. I mean, there's a lot of shit in here. You can literally see the seeds, mm -hmm. oatmeal and shit. Yep. You think it's chewy? I think the texture is pretty great. Yeah, I agree. Did you already eat it? Oh. <laughs> it's gone. That's how good it was. I think the texture's pretty good. Mm. I'm actually really digging this bar. The flavor is fucking top notch. Yeah. The flavor is really good. And I mean, keep this shit in mind. This is plant based. And. Like, straight up. Like I said, there's no artificial sweetener. Yeah. Straight up. That's Ta a, tapioca uh, syrup. Yeah, that's a plus. Tapioca syrup. What's the other one? Yeah, I think it's just tapioca syrup is the sweetener. <clears throat> mm -hmm. probably nope, straight up sugar. Straight up sugar. Regular, regular sugar. Too. The coating. Well, that's the coating. The coating is sugar, sugar, palm kernel, palm kernel oil, mm -hmm. salt. Yeah. I actually think this is a pretty damn good bar. Like. For vegan plant-based? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anytime I eat a vegan bar, I'm always like. 
You know, it's either going to taste like shit or just very bland. Yeah, you, you have some preconceptions. Yeah, exactly. What it like, yeah. yeah, you're like, this is definitely going to taste like shit. Yeah. Nope. Oh. I'm impressed by it. I, I can eat this over a lot of whey protein bars I've had. Yeah. Like, there's some bad whey yeah. ones. Oh, this yeah. is definitely one of the top notch plant yeah. based, I think. Yeah. Man, that's pretty good. I'm really digging this one. We've reviewed a few plant based things this weekend, too, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. This is, this is up there. This is up there. Yeah, it's up there. Mm -hmm. Man, what do you think? Right, 10. Oh, shit. Man, I can say right off the bat that the, the packaging, the whole packaging, the appeal of it it's, is it's, right there. It's definitely appealing, yeah. Yeah, it's appealing. Gluten free, non GMO. Vegan. Vegan, all natural. Yeah. No sugar alcohol. No sugar alcohol. Yeah. I mean, only 8 grams of sugar. That's not that bad. It's got a lot of pluses to it. This guy, it definitely does. It's only 170 calories. Yeah, too. And it actually feels kind of filling. There's a lot of protein bars that are the same exact yeah. size with less protein that are upwards of 250 calories. Yeah. Yeah. So I think for as, as far as like a small The price stack, point, though. Yeah. Well, actually, point. it's only $2 a bar, really. $2 a bar? That's not bad. It's really not that bad. Actually, well, yeah. When you buy a whole box. I'm realizing all these incredible things about it. Now I want more. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when you buy a box, you're like eight bucks. That sounds expensive, but then when you realize it, we buy other bars and we're like two fifty a piece. It's like, well, actually, this is actually cheaper. Yeah, you know. Yeah, and once it once again, this is for a recreational fitness person because, as we know, people that are are professional or even amateur bodybuilders or powerlifters, they're going to be eating two, three, four protein bars a day and they're not gonna to be supplement that. Yeah, they're not going to be doing those. Yeah, because the price point's so high when you can go on. TJ's Fitness Deals News, and you can get two cases. <laughs> you can get two cases of combat of Muscle yeah. Farm Combat, and they end up being twenty five cents a fucking bar. That's true too. Yeah, so I think I think for the this bar, like it's, it's also kind of filling. Like it's a uh, it's satisfying for what you're getting. Like you're getting like a decent amount of food out yeah. of it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think overall, I'm gonna give this one like eight point five. I totally agree with you. Eight point five. Yep, I will totally agree. God with eight point five. Yep. Wow, eight point five. Eight point five on the taste alone. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, wow. not to mention not to mention the very appealing packaging, the plant, the, the fact that it's plant based yeah. and, and gluten free and all that. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm almost tempted to give it a nine. I'm like no joke, no <laughs> joke. Yeah, yeah, it's really? it's it's very appealing. Yeah, I, I'm it's totally digging this. Yeah. This is definitely good. Yeah, it's and, good we, shit. and we actually reviewed some of their other shit, so it's not like we're being biased. Yeah, towards yeah we did brand some of their some of their protein bites. Yep. yep. No, we weren't totally biased towards those at all. Like nope. we were like these, these are, are always shit. honest. Completely Always unbiased. honest motherfucking opinion. Yep, yep. Ain't nobody paying me to say that this bar is fucking nope. good. Not yet, at least. <laughs> I paid eight dollars for this goddamn box in fucking California. You can check. California. You can check my goddamn receipt. We know how to party. <laughs> you can check my goddamn receipt. I paid eight dollars for this motherfucker at Target. All right. Which one? Uh, San Diego, California. Is yeah, one? Is uh, one? one? Oh my god! There's like nine targets in San Diego. <laughs> it this was is, one. This of them. is the Point Loma location. It was one of them. That's all I know. Midway drive. Anyways, that's me for much of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for the support. As always, let me know what you want to see next. If you don't like it too fucking bad, subscribe, share, like, and comment below. Scroll, but don't troll. Ain't no haters because we're fucking swole. Don't forget to follow me on my social media. I'm fitness. Facebook, I'm fitness. Snapchat, I'm fitness. Instagram, I'm fitness. Don't forget to like my bed. God damn. Yeah, I know, right? Divided <laughs> Dimension is what you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> Divided, Divided dimension. dimension on Spotify. Shop Love Yourself and Needs at TigerFitness.com. Go ahead and plug your shit. Oh. Go ahead and plug your shit. If you love rock and roll music, especially these 90 covers. Oh, get, shit. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> if, you like this, if you like 90s cover tunes, rock and roll music, make sure you follow my band on Instagram, ShineboxSD, and on Facebook at Shinebox the Band. If you want to see me and my originals and me singing music, playing music, make sure you follow me on Instagram at Lobo the Voice and on Facebook at Trevor Lobo Welsh. I think we're done plugging shit. Let's go and shut it down. We'll check you guys later.